In this video, you'll learn how to segment, split, and count objects in your images and display data from your image. First, open your image and go to the Count Size tab. Press the Measurements and Class Reset buttons to clear any old values. In the Segment group, select which segmentation method you wish to utilize. Bright is used for segmenting bright objects on a dark background, dark for segmenting dark objects on a bright background, and Smart for using the Smart Segmentation tool. This tool will be discussed in a separate online tutorial. As this is a fluorescent image, we're going to use the Bright option to perform our segmentation. Use the Threshold tool to adjust the thresholding for your segmentation. Decreasing the Threshold Min will include dimmer pixels in your object identification. Click on the dropper icon and select a pixel from your image to include that pixel intensity in your segmentation. Click the plus symbol to add more classes to your data set. Click on the Types drop-down menu to select which measurement values you want included in your data set. Click Save if you wish to save these measurement options for later use. Click Count to perform a count of your objects. If you have objects that need to be split, for example two touching cells, you can use the Split tool to enable splitting. Select the option to split objects with count if you want the split objects to be included in your final data. Adjust your separation method based on your objects. Boundary shape will split by looking for concavities in objects. This works best on clusters created by round objects. Watershed splits by eroding objects until they disappear and then dilates them again so they do not touch. This method is effective if your objects are not convex, like a cell with rounded nucleus. If ridge size is enabled, only objects wider than the given width get separated. If unchecked, ridge size is unlimited. The split tool allows you to manually split an object. Click on one end of a desired split region and then double click on the other to create a split line. Click on the apply split button to apply that split to the image. Click on the Data Table button to display the data from your image. The data presented is based on the measurement type selected in the Types menu. Clicking Statistics will display statistical information of all objects in the entire image. The Excel button will export data presented in the Data Table to Excel software.